there's definitely something coming. <laughs> Supposedly there's tornado warnings with it. The boys work over that way and they said the power's out already as soon as the storm hit them, so. Let's go see if we can post up and watch it roll in, I guess. Calm before the storm. We're bailing.
Peter. <laughs> Wow. Oh, my hat. <laughs> there goes the cardboard. Oh man. Jeez. Well, we're definitely getting some rain. Hopefully these trees hold up. Power's already out as soon as the wind started. We lost a couple branches. Guess they don't have to get anybody to come cut them off. Oh man. Use the lightning. Soda's overflowing.
was a crazy one. Sounds like it's just straight thunder and non-stop. trees over by the woods just getting ripped. Guy is angry. It's just straight thunder the whole time. Well, I sure am glad we're getting the water.
long as the wind didn't blow the blueberries off, this is going to help a lot. They really needed it. Needed these branches taken out of this tree over here, too. <laughs> so. I don't see nothing flipped. That's good. I'll have to see how Chair Mountains <laughs> fared this storm. side of it. Seems like it's over for the most part, hopefully. I'll go check the radar. Alright everybody, thanks for watching. We made it. <laughs> yeah, we lost a couple tree branches. Still didn't get that one or that one. <laughs> but that's why we moved the cars. They would have both been right on top of that white van. Looks like Chair Mountain's still intact. <laughs> Five o'clock, power's still out. I don't know when they're going to get here to fix this. Jeez. Well, the power's still out. Five o'clock, same day as the storm. Sun's shining. So we back this thing in here and change the oil. I already did that. I'm going to have to uh, do this oil bath. And um, I tightened the belt for the jack shaft. So that's good. I really want to take the valve cover off and adjust the valves. But I'm um, probably going to wait until the next time I cut grass and then do it. Do it after that. Because this rain is really going to make this stuff sprout up in the next couple days. So I'll knock it down and then I'll worry about it. Hopefully I'll have time. Not to make time, right? So by rocking the generators, round two's coming. Some people are saying we might be without power till Friday. Well, it's Thursday morning. We're still without power, so. Been uh, swapping the generator around between a couple of freezers and fridge most of the night. Uh, hopefully, they get the power on soon. <laughs> you gotta hook back up over here. I have a, a battery backup, uh, a battery set up in the in the living room that we run the TV and some fans and stuff off of, and uh, I put one of my solar panels on the quarter of the fence there. We got a little while till it till it gets to it, but the the battery bank in the living room still chilling at 12.7, so it's good. The old lady's got a fan at least, and plug the t plug the fridge back in get that stuff freezing we had to consolidate a bunch of stuff from another freezer into the one fridge and it's just a mess it's crazy uh, hopefully the power comes back on we just seen the trucks go down the road to where the trees down so hopefully they get that cleared up but 
I'm gonna go load up some scrap, take a ride to the other scrap yard, and see if I can get some junk batteries. Let me go get this stuff out of here. See if they have anything up there. It's worth it's worth salvaging. Well, they're finally getting it off of there. Sheesh. <laughs> On our way to the yard, taking in some batteries and some number two copper wire. To see what some of these prices are doing. See if there's any good ones over there. I need help. I'm surrounded by dodges. Oh my god, they're chasing me. Oh, well, I called home. I guess the power just came back on, so that's good. Let's go see what some of these prices are. Maybe we can get some batteries. Old Fred and the Dirty Dodge. <laughs> Damn, Isaiah, could you get a bigger truck? No, I'm trying to. <laughs> You're trying to? Yeah, trying Look at these blocks you got on this bad boy. What happened to the Chevy? Transmission died, man. I you want to get rid of it or no? It's gone. Oh, it why didn't you let me know? It sure was gone know. instantly, man. Yeah. There's a million people that wanted it. Who the hell put this bed on here? Yeah, nice gas Fred. door. Me and Fred. Mainly Fred. <laughs> Mainly Fred. Mainly Fred. Mainly Fred. <laughs> nice tailgate. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I thought so. It's got to be hell trying to load this thing yeah though, it is it's hot it's too hot in the ass. yeah and i'm getting too old for all this stuff man. <laughs> how's everything going in your world man? it's going it's going i was what you got what the, is there bailing wire holding it yeah. oh my god y'all thought i was bad yeah. <laughs> yeah. it's holding it yeah i'm gonna go get a cart Uh, we got a few things. Not too crazy. We got the good batteries. Beat me to them. Oh, there is some big ones here, huh? Oh, here we go. 16. Four years old. A couple big ones over there. So we got a bent stud. Oh, maybe I can get. We gotta find a wire. All right, well, we got 2018, 8 of 18, Napa Deep Cycle, golf cart battery, and then these two, one of them, this one's a 19, 719, and I couldn't find a date on that one, but it's pretty hot, but they'll be good enough to run the fans on the tent. I think it was uh, 53 bucks. Can't beat that, right? What are you doing? <laughs> I think they got them cribbed up. What about these? these big ones you see a date on them 17, 17. they're probably still good yeah I'm that's like pretty old though now. yeah i hear you but i just need that's some you almost come here every other time you can find good i know yeah good. yeah yeah that's what's good but these ones probably still got enough juice in them yeah, to like yeah. run yeah. my fans and stuff yeah. you know they're, but they're a funny name they, on, they only wanted a 53 for those other three so okay. and i have one golf cart battery that's like the studs yeah, melded the one battery car, the battery. yeah the cart battery is worth yeah. it Look at this. i know i know i was using one of these wires it got so hot i tried to buy you one of these before like at that price yeah and they wouldn't do it try to sell it and it's like borderline yeah oh i see a chainsaw fred it just yeah, there's a fuel search ball. Oh, 
bunch of crap. All right. Damn, Fred did snag the good ones. 12 of 9, they're brand new. Man. Jeez. Get some prices here. Well, 23 cents on batteries. Motors are at 12 cents. Wire's still at 50, so it's not too bad. Prices are coming back up. 10 cents on the ballast sealed units. So 63 bucks, but we spent 50 on batteries. But hey, we need them. Let's see what these bad boys are doing. This one's a little low. It's definitely weak, but it's holding, so that's a good sign. And it bounces back, even though it's not not even 12 volts. We got to get that thing on a solar panel ASAP. This one I think was way hotter. Oh, well, maybe not. This was the weaker one. Oh, this one's probably shot. Yeah. That's why you always bring your load tester with you. Oh, well. we'll take it back next week get another one. Hopefully this one's good. I need this for the cart. Well, it's in the okay. It's actually loading. Alright, dead on six, so this thing needs to get charged up too. Alright, well we'll probably end up with two good ones out of the deal. And we're just buying them for scrap price, so it's not like we're really losing anything. They might be charging us a couple cents more, but whatever. It's a scratch-off ticket, right? Alright everybody, thanks for watching. Hit that thumbs up. Subscribe, all that good stuff. Here comes the crows. Later.